Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Loli Suma. And if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back, darling. I'm really, really, I really appreciate you tuning back into the channel. And if you're new and you've not subscribed, please, please, please do subscribe. On today's video, I am, today's Friday. Um, it's Friday afternoon, it's about half past four now. And I'm traveling on Sunday. So, between today and tomorrow, I need to prepare for my travel on Sunday. So, I want to take you guys along. Um, the first thing I did was go get a COVID test, which is the clip that you just saw um, before this. And that's because I'm not vaccinated. I don't have a thingy. So, I just get a PCR test just to be safe. I don't think they'll ask for it, but I just got a test just to be safe the things on my to-do list was the pcr test my hair i need to do my hair i need to do my nails to refill i need to clean my house i need to do laundry i need to also get some toiletries so yeah between now and tomorrow before i sleep we need to have take that off and i'm going to take uh, take you guys along as i do that right now with my hair I'm honestly just wild cutting it. I just searched on TikTok for a hair salon close to me. Uh, and I hope they're open. I'm gonna go and see if they're open. If not, I'll do that tomorrow. Why did I say, let's go see if the salon is open? I'm sure the salon is open. I just don't have an appointment. So I wanna actually see if they will take me in and do my hair now. <laughs> or if not, I need to make an appointment for tomorrow. I don't know why i said i need to check if it's open but let's go see if they can actually do my hair today <music> good morning guys it's like five to eight and i've got my eight o'clock nail appointment now i managed to do my hair yesterday i just did wig lines so now let's go get our nails done i actually left the i put my laundry in the washing machine at least while i'm getting my nails done then my laundry will be getting done and then when i come back i'll just hang it up and that will be like killing two birds with one stone smart girl smart girl <laughs> done pink in so long it's cute okay our nails are done on to the next task
the most important part about me prepping to go away or when i know that i need to travel the week building up to the day i'm leaving i don't buy anything um and if i cook i cook like early in the week knowing that i'll eat the food and finish it towards the end of the week but i don't buy groceries i don't i only probably cook once so that i can eat the food and finish because i don't want to leave anything in the fridge for i mean i'm leaving for a week i don't want to leave anything in the fridge that's not going to be consumed for a week and then coming back trying to eat something that she left in the fridge for a week also i then try to clear the fridge of anything that might go off while i'm away so part of my cleaning process is cleaning out the fridge so let's see what is inside my fridge and what is gonna stay and what i'm gonna take what i'm gonna throw out i also want to clean the fridge so don't judge that it's dirty i'm gonna take out all the cylinders and everything and clean it um so that it's clean so yeah let's go through what's in my fridge i don't know if this is a good idea if you guys are going to judge me or what <laughs> okay so right at the top we've got eggs i keep my eggs in the fridge so those are staying they're not gonna go off and then up here i've got these fruits that i bought quite a while ago they're already like i don't know no i can't eat this anymore like it's shoshoban i don't know if you can see but it's shoshoban oh girl don't cry oh i forgot about my cottage but you see i'm gonna have this for dinner so this is still fine we'll have this for dinner the cheese is gonna stay the butter is staying um all of this is fine what's in here this is cabbage that i made a very long time ago that's not safe anymore I'm taking this out. Grapes, I will finish them today. That's another thing. Like now I have to try and finish off. Oh my goodness. Okay, what do I do? Okay, so you see the corn? Should I throw these out, guys? Like, what if I cut? What if I cut like here? And then cook the rest. <laughs> This is what I struggle with, like staying alone and your food going off. Like I struggle with like throwing things away. So, but I'm going to be gone for another week. I think I'm going to throw these away. Like Then we have watermelon, which is almost done. I'm going to eat this today. I'm going to finish it. I'm going to make a little fruit salad with the grapes. Uh, these veggies I'm not gonna be able to cook so I'm gonna put them in the freezer I'm not throwing them out they're still fresh uh, the little bit of yogurt that's left here yeah, I'll have muesli tomorrow morning before I leave so that's fine we can leave that can I freeze broccoli I don't know broccoli please comment and let me know if I can freeze broccoli for now I'm going to freeze it because you I'm not going to see your comments in time. So I'm going to freeze this. I don't know. I'll see when I come back. And then this is beetroot, which won't go off. It's fine. So I'm going to keep that in there. So our biggest problem is actually in here. The, I mean, look at my carrot. <laughs> The carrot, these are still fine actually. I must just take them out of the plastic. The tomatoes are still okay. They might be off when I come back, but I'm gonna leave them there. Um yeah, my green peppers are not looking so appetizing. But you know what? I can't throw them out. So I'm gonna leave them. We'll see when I come back if they'll be okay.
bought three of these fridge storage things honestly i'm not um organize your cupboard i'm not an organizational storage person but load shedding four to six damn okay um four to six okay then i can go to the mall at that time so i got these from pep home for 54.99 which is 55 rand and I'm gonna sort out the veggie rack, which you saw was a bit of a mess. I'm disappointed they're not sitting like this they're too long so i had to put it like that but tell me what you guys think at least now i feel like it looks a bit neater what do you think and that's the rest of the stuff that i've packed back nothing happening much on this side this is all like canned bottled stuff so it's not gonna go and this is all for the fridge and since i've shown you the inside let me actually show you the outside of my fridge okay if you are new on my channel this basically sums up all my travel um expedites what's the word i don't know anyway so here are these two this is when i went to france for the first time i did paris I did Paris, I did Cannes, Cannes, however you say it, and I did Nice. So these three cities I went to, and I did Provence as well. I did Provence as well. Did I? I think so. We went to the south of France somewhere, and either Provence or French River, I'm not sure what it is, but yeah. This was Phuket. Oh, so for France, I've got all the vlogs on my channel. You can go check them out. Phuket there's no vlogs for Phuket this is Phuket as well I went in 2019 Kenya there's a vlog on my channel go and watch it and this is France again and then Mpumalanga we went to the portals and we went to the three rendezvous as well as God's window go check the vlog out on my channel as well and this one I went whale watching in Hermanus I'm sure there's a vlog on my channel as well. Go check that out. I also went to Turkey and there's a vlog for that as well. But I forgot to buy a fridge magnet. Like I'm so, I was so sad when I came back. I was like, how could I forget to buy a fridge magnet? So next time I go to Turkey, I'm definitely going to get a fridge magnet. And then when I come back from my trip that I'm leaving for tomorrow, we'll have another fridge magnet. So that basically sums up my travel life. Yeah.
of this vibe and I am at the mall. In terms of time, I did very well with my time today, actually. Um, but I don't want to spend too much time here, so I'm going to try to be quick in and out. Guys, it's midnight and I'm somewhat done packing or I've packed like 80% like my clothes and stuff tomorrow morning I'll just pack like my toiletries and my shoes anyway it's midnight and I need to close this vlog so I just want to show you guys what I've got at the mall and then call it a night because I need to be up early I got these um simple black sneakers or whatever you want to call them i got them at mr price for like um 200 rand one of my colleagues advised that um i wear closed shoes and they mustn't be white so i my i have like two pairs of white sneakers and another that's not white so i don't have a black one so i just took this and then i'll take the other one that's not white um at least i'll have two options to wear also from mr price i got some cute pajamas i got some cute little pjs because i was due for new pjs um yeah i think this is cute i like the color this was 169 um yeah i needed a new pair of pjs so i got these I just got my toner that was finished as well as cotton um cotton pads. Lastly, I got an adapter. I've got a South African adapter um for wherever I'm going. And that's all that I got from the mall, guys. So if you've watched this far, thank you so much for watching. Like my eyes, I can feel my eyes falling asleep. Thank you so much for watching. And please do tune on to the next video to see where I'm going. <laughs> and um, yeah, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. If you've not subscribed, please, please, please do subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye.